Mike Wilcoxon back at you at one click away. And today we're going to talk about affiliate marketing, what affiliate marketing is, and how you can use it in your own life to make yourself some extra money. Let's get into it. Now, affiliate marketing is a somewhat complicated sounding term, but in all reality, it's a really, really simple concept. What affiliate marketing is, is basically you being the salesman, if you will, to promote other companies and other people's products and services. So what you do is you kind of create a brand around yourself, which is one of the best ways to do it, and pick a niche or a niche, whatever the correct pronunciation is, uh, some of them, for example, are fitness, wellness, uh, personal finance, like what I do, uh, investing, uh, diet things like you know the keto diet. Uh, there's a bunch of good ones out there, but anyway, pick something that you'd be interested in, and you as yourself uh, promote whatever this field is, and you can promote products and services within the field to your audience that you start to build over time. And as you keep going and you keep creating content constantly that has educational value or is entertaining or really captivates people and makes them want to learn more about you and learn more about the products they're promoting, you'll gain this following and then more and more people will see you and your products and then more and more people hopefully will decide to believe in you and believe in what you're telling them. They'll build trust with you, and then in turn they will buy the products through you uh, at these companies. And when they use your referral links, then you will gain a commission based on that sale because you referred them to go and buy this product. And the companies or the people that you're using to... Uh, you promote these products, they will pay you a certain amount of money. So as you can imagine, if you grow your following and grow it and grow it and you create, you keep creating educational, valuable content that's captivating, that persuades people to trust you and invest in you and persuades people to buy those products through you, then you know, the more money that you will ultimately make. And that is really quick down and dirty in a nutshell you know, what affiliate marketing really is when it comes down to it. So how does the regular person go about getting started with affiliate marketing? Well, there's a great course out there. It's been a very valuable experience to me so far. And I'm really interested in it. And it's just me right now beginning to grow my audience and my business from the ground up. And I'm getting into affiliate marketing to supplement my income that I already have. And I'm not in any way in a bad spot. I just want to be in a better spot. And I want to make more money. And I have the entrepreneurial spirit. And I'm willing to put in the hard work and dedication to build my affiliate marketing business. Uh, really, we do affiliate marketing in everyday life anyways. Uh, when I say that, what I'm really referring to is a lot of times in regular conversation, we go talk to people. And in conversation, we're like, hey, you know I I just bought this really cool new thing. It really helps me out do this or that at home or it's really cool and exciting or it's really fun to use, whatever it is. And you're talking to this person like, oh, yeah, it sounds good, you know, and, you know, it's pretty good chances that the person you are talking to, you know, you know them well, you've built a certain rapport with them, you know, whether it's family, obviously you have a good rapport with them, hopefully, uh, you know, a friend or just a colleague, there's a certain level of trust that you've already built with them and, Based on that and your reputation with them, they put a certain amount of trust and interest in what you're saying, and that helps them when they analyze what you're saying and decide if they want to also purchase that product or not. And when they go purchase that product, um, they're basically doing it, at least in part, because you referred this product to them. And that's essentially what, what affiliate marketing is. So you've probably been doing a form of affiliate marketing your whole life. There's a lot of companies that offer affiliate programs and just a real quick just off the top 
A bunch of the big name, big box companies offer it. Uh, one of the simplest and easiest to use is Amazon. Okay, Costco I think has one. BJ's, maybe Best Buy, Walmart. A ton of people, a ton of different businesses have affiliate programs. Uh, some online ones that I can think of off the top of my head. Fiverr has one. Uh, Digistore24 is another one. Um, I don't know. There's a bunch. Uh, but what you do is you basically go online to one of these companies and look for on the website somewhere where it says affiliate program or apply to be an affiliate. Uh, I'm just going to use Amazon as an example because it's probably the most popular one. And you go on there and sign up under the Amazon Affiliates program. You might just have to Google it. Punch it in and create an account. And once you follow all the steps, you become an Amazon Affiliate. I think it takes a couple days for them to actually approve you, but it's free. And what you do once you get approved is, you know, consider your, your niche, what you want to, um, what field you want to be in as far as growing your social media presence. Uh, again, take mine for example personal finance so I'm gonna go into Amazon and I'm gonna find uh, products or services or digital products or books whatever it is that have to do with personal finance and then I'm gonna go onto my social media or YouTube or whatever it is and create videos and content around this product and I'm going to show people the good things about it the bad things give kinda of like an honest review and you do a couple of different videos about it, whatever that product is. Let's say you just picked one for now. And you continue to make valuable, educational, captivating content for your audience. And, and you put the referral link from that you get from the Amazon Affiliates website. You'll see how to do it in there. You take that link because it's got a personal code related to you and your account. And you stick it in the description of your YouTube video or your social media post. Okay, and once enough people see that video and you grow enough rapport with them, you're like, okay, I like this guy, I like what he's got to say, good product, let me give it a shot, and they click on that link and they go to the website. When they buy it is when uh, you eventually get paid a commission from them buying it through Amazon. Now, I think Amazon's uh, commission rates are a little low. They have like a chart that tells you, you know, how much percentage of the sale that you're going to get per sale. Uh, and then they give you a payout for that. So obviously the more sales you make, the more videos that you have, the more followers you have, increases the chance that you're going to make, you know, more money, etc. So that, that's generally how it works. Uh, Amazon's a good one to start with. Um, remember though, don't just promote this one product that you find off of Amazon. You want to make videos and content about things that have to do with your your whole niche, your whole field that that you're in. All right, and then once you do that and you make that valuable content that's educational and you grow a following, then you want to insert you know products into your content as it is. Um, maybe after you get comfortable. Maybe you don't just make a video or content about that one product. Maybe you make it about a similar subject and you talk about that subject and you give valuable information about that subject. And then if it relates to what you're talking about, you could you know, insert the information about the product that you're trying to make an affiliate sale on within your video uh, here and there and make videos like that instead. Again, do this over time and eventually you should be making some sales. Uh, again, it's all about consistency, hard work, creating content continuously all the time, and eventually you should start getting some traction to your social media sites. Um, I recommend, once you get a little comfortable, um, I, I would recommend going on to a website like ClickFunnels, for example. On uh, ClickFunnels, you can make uh, an online sales funnel it's called to when people click on your link in your bio or whatever people say i'm sure you've seen it maybe on tiktok that they go first to the site which is your funnel and it collects their email address and the best way to get them to do that is for you to offer some kind of freebie product in return maybe it's some kind of digital product maybe it's like a handout or an infographic or something like that 
in exchange to get their email. All right, you want to create, start creating an email list, and that way later on you can get uh, an email autoresponder, uh, get response, Aweber, uh, constant contact, I think is another one. Um, these will help you build and maintain those email lists as well as help you to create emails to send out to your uh, followers and the people who subscribe to your your email newsletter so that you can continue to interact with these people you already know are interested try and pitch them new content via email new ideas and new products and continue to keep them updated and informed about your niche and what you're all about so there you go real down and dirty that's what affiliate marketing is and I'm going to make more videos about affiliate marketing and about the 15 day challenge and what exactly that is in a little bit more detail, but you basically got the gist of it down and dirty. What affiliate marketing is, it's when you push or promote a product or service on behalf of another company. And when you make that sale, you get a commission of that sale, a certain percentage of the money from that sale. All right. If you guys have any more questions, let me know. Uh, give me a like, give me a follow, subscribe to the notification bell. Leave a comment and let me know what you want to hear about next. Appreciate your guys' time and patience. My name is Mike Wilcoxon. Thanks for coming back to One Click Away, and we'll see you soon. Oh, and remember, you might just be one click away from learning something brand new that could change your life or your financial future for the better. Uh, so remember that. If you haven't taken the One Click Away Challenge yet, go ahead and take it. Click on something new. Click on a different video that I have. Go to my website, www.oneclickawaychallenge.com. Check out the video classroom or a bunch of the other products and services that I use and that I recommend for you. All right. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next time.